awesome. Yo, what's up, everyone? How you doing? Um, so we're doing Mario 64 Randomizer today, and we want to do 120 star. Um, so for full transparency, I'll be doing a 120 star run right now. But if we don't meet the incentive um, before I hit 70 stars, I'm out of here. <laughs> <laughs> so uh, you, you better get those donations in for the full 120 star run. Um, this seat I'm playing right now is random. I've never played it before. Um, it was tested by uh, Author Bluesto to make sure there's no impossible stars anywhere or game crashes or something like that. Um, and then before we start, maybe introduce the couch really quick. Simple flips. I'm dark man. I don't know anything about this game. But I'm Chris's <laughs> number one fanboy. <laughs> Thanks. Yeah. All right. Uh, yeah, and we're ready to start. Um, I'm using a tracker on a laptop on the side that basically I'll, I'll mark stuff so remember where each stage leads to. We'll explain what the randomizer does mid-run. Um, Okay, I'm good to go then. All right, three, two, one, go. Good luck. All right, thank you. Got this. Ah, <laughs> oh, you don't have to MIPS clip? No, no the intro skips. We don't need. We, we don't need. <laughs> we, we, we don't need the intro. The, the, you know, you know what I mean. Yeah, yeah, that thing. <laughs> Lucky to skip. So there's two stages open from the very start, and it's that's Vanish Cap and uh, Bob, and. I like opening Vanish Cap first just so the water is gone. Because if I find Vanish Cap right away, I won't be able to exit it because there's water outside. And I don't want to swim around uh, in the moat. I did not know that you didn't have to collect the keys, or at least I didn't remember it. <laughs> no, yeah, we don't need any keys. Oh, interesting. All the star doors are open. So uh, as for what is random, um, every level entrance is random. <laughs> there's like a random <laughs> one-up <laughs> loading. Oh, hey. Um, all right, first star, easy. All right, look at that. So like, you know, 119 to go, we'll be done in like, you know, 30 seconds, something like that. Okay, um, yeah, stars, coins, enemies, warp locations, everything's random. Oh man. That's not very good. No, I don't like that HMC isn't a stage, but that's all right. What kind of seat did Arthur give me? <laughs> <laughs> he gave you a playable seat. He didn't ask yeah. for anything more than that. Okay. Oh. Yeah, Aquarium is a, is a really weird one. Sometimes it's incredibly fast, and sometimes you swim around for two minutes and can't find the last coin. Like now? I don't know. <laughs> I have no idea where it is. I believe. <laughs> it's a bit hard. Oh, there it is. Bit hard to see. Okay, I might want to move a little closer to the TV actually. Um, not sure if the cameras need to be adjusted for that. Nah, you're fine. You look beautiful. Okay, thank you. You're right too. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So I, I use a tracker that basically connects the stages um, in in loops, so I know. Uh, where everything leads to, and if something is done, like right now HMC that led to um, the aquarium, I mark that as red and it's, it's, I don't have to go back there anymore. Okay, I'm gonna go for the, the wiggler. Oh. Little mountain clip into the loading zone. So yeah, that is actually a star I would go for. So far, every star I went for, um, I would actually go for in 70 star too. <laughs> All right. Uh, if you have any donations going, uh, you can go ahead now. Absolutely, and to give you a little update, we are at 19,319 out of the $25,000 incentive for the upgrade to 120 star. So yeah, let's keep making that happen. With donations like $15 from the Snuddles, who says, let's get 120 stars. Come on, Chrism Chat. <laughs> $120 from Anonymous, $120 for 120 stars. And a $5 donation from Thunderware with just a heart. Thank you. All right. Hopefully you gave me a good seat, man. <laughs> <laughs> seat does matter a lot for like a good time. But I'm, I'm pretty confident I can be underestimated by a lot anyway. Yeah. 
So, like, how do you know where you're going and, like, why you're going, like, certain places and doing certain things? Certain, just certain, like, routes I take throughout the level. Right now, I was looking for the, the open star, but I couldn't find it. So I go for the boss instead. So, like, the boss is where they are in, like, the original game. They're still there for the randomizer? Yeah, you can't, you can't put the boss somewhere else. Okay. It would probably break the game. Well, okay. summon them, because, like... Okay. The Wiggler's in the same spot. Yeah. This is in the same spot. Right. But the Womp and the, the This Womp room we're in right now is a different loading zone. Okay. So you can't really put anything out of it. Gotcha. All right. And then the star is a random. So I go for this star sometimes in 70 star too, because it's. The star spawns right next to you every time. Oh. Tiny huge island led to shifting. If I make any mistakes tracking, you guys gotta tell me about it. <laughs> nope. <Indeed>. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> You're on your own. Okay, wing cap's a little tough. If you want to go for more donations, uh, just go for it. Sure thing, and we are under $5,000 away from making it a 120 star run. Thank you all so much. Let's keep those donations coming. $5 from Anonymous is choo choo, said the donation train. Also have $20 from Ardia Abe, said let's unlock 50 more stars. Sizgi, I, I definitely pronounced that wrong, I apologize, said uh, let's get that 120 stars, loving the randomizer runs at GDQ lately with their $25 donation. That's an interesting spot to put the star in. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> can, they, they can't like accidentally just like put it in the sky, can they? And I think the there are certain limitations that okay. prevent. Like it has to be a certain height from the ground. Okay. Minimum, maximum. Gotcha. Don't be like, no, you need the wing cap again. <laughs> Good luck. <laughs> oh, oops. Okay, I'm going back for the vanish cap since eight. This is HMC. Uh, HMC is not. Oh, I lost signal. All right, it's back. All good. Um, since HMC is not a stage and the door that leads to HMC is probably not open yet, uh, I'll be going to Metal Cap now and continue the loop somewhere else. Because a lot of... Oh, yeah, another thing that's randomized is star door requirements are completely random. There might be a door out there that needs, like, 60 stars to be opened. What? <laughs> wow. In the basement, for example, yeah. Could okay. Oh, not a good angle. I hate that side flip. There we go. Let's see if author was uh, didn't lie to me. <laughs> this better not be a stage. Gonna be warmed. <laughs> no. <laughs> okay, it's fi it's feisty. Oh god. Uh, Wow, that's <laughs> quite a place to put a coin. Oh, there's so many down here, all right. Okay, I, oh yeah, I do pause a lot to check the pause screen for um, stars and coins, uh, because the pause screen gives you a, like a very wide uh, camera angle. point in time where like you go on a stage and you're like eh, I don't really want to do that now no oh. in 120 star <laughs> I, I just always got to go for the stars yeah okay in 70 star I would a lot a lot of times exit or die on purpose just so I can continue the loop because there's no more fast stars to go for mm -hmm. 70 star is very stressful not even close not even close oh that's it nice cool that's pretty good, all things considered. Here we go. So Firesley, for example, since we, uh, yeah, thank you. Um, since we don't need, oh, that was a slope jump. All right, falling all the way, I guess. Um, we don't need the key. All the key doors are open, so we just die. Yeah. Could you kill Bowser if you wanted to, though? 
You, yeah, you could. Nope. <laughs> the true 100% run. <laughs> All right, BBH is probably the slowest stage uh, in the whole game because there's so many doors and like rooms you'd have to go through, and you can't really see any un unless you enter them. So I usually start with by checking the outside for a, a boss like this or and the open star. There's one open star. Okay, don't look at me, it's fine. So he's got a big eye, alright. Probably on the roof. Ah, in the basement, that's fine. It's always faster to go down than to go up, so. Yeah, ghost hunt here is a pain. You have to find uh, five five boos and then the boss too, and then still grab the star that's random again. <laughs> and red coins here, obviously, even worse. Eight red coins to be found. It wasn't here, right? Yeah. Okay. DDD to BBH. There you go. If you have any more donations, go for it. Sure thing. Mad Beggar donates $200, saying helping with the final push for that 120 star randomizer run. Best of luck to Chris and tell him that we all said hi. Chris hi. <laughs> also have $20 from Anonymous who says, can't upgrade to infinite stars, so I'll settle for 120 dumplings. I mean, stars. <laughs> Let's go. Smash Mouth donated $25, <laughs> saying, hey now, you're an all-star. Get your game on. Go play. <laughs> Okay. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> Must be there is like 12 boxes in uh, Wet Dry World and two of them have stars. Were you, so like, were you trying for that or just like, yeah, yeah, just, just be like, yeah, why not? Yeah, I, I, I was just going for it as if it was the Starbucks. Okay, cool. <laughs> <laughs> right. That's lucky. Uh, it's actually pretty rare that something spawns up there nowadays in this version. Oh, okay. So would they like make you climb all the way up here? Yeah. Yep. Oh no. <laughs> ho, 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 ho. <laughs> this is great. I think the the spawner was low, so it, we only have to climb it once and then. Oh. Oh. It's all right. Grab the coins on the way down. There's one. Oh, no, it's up here. Oh, no, so I gotta climb it. I do have to climb it twice. That's a little unlucky. I get the Vanish Cap, uh, even though you don't really need it in... Oh, actually, you do need it in Vanilla. Uh, in Randomizer, you technically don't need it, but there could be a star behind a Vanish Cap wall in Wet Dry World. That's, the, I think, the only place you really need the Vanish Cap for. You'll hear that a lot. There's a lot of floats <laughs> in this game. Give me that fire. There you go. <laughs> I like it. Okay, that was Wet Dry World, I believe, to Vanish Cap. <laughs> Thank you. And that's why I want Vanish Cap to be open first, so I can just go for it right away. All right. We're doing this. HMC 100, probably the slowest star in the game. Besides BOB, uh, BBH 100. I know what slow stars mean. <laughs> That's time for some <laughs> donations, right? <laughs> yes. Per Panda threw in $10 after watching that prize segment, said, I want a PS4 and 50 more stars. 50 from Big Boss 11 and says, let's go 120 stars. And Hello Planet donated $15, said, let's go for 120 stars. Had to donate during one of my favorite runs. We are just over $3,000 away from that 120 star incentive. So please keep those donations coming for Able Gamers, everybody. Oh, I wasn't sure if I saw anything there. Okay, I couldn't find the uh, spawner of the star yet, so I'll be going down first. And then ride the elevator up. Yeah, there's like a 100 coin route I usually follow just 
generally checking the corners. I got like the. Uh, oh man, that's <laughs> gonna. <laughs> okay. Oh, <laughs> that's an interesting placement. Oh, okay. <laughs> that was really close. Um, yeah, just checking every corner that I know the coins are usually when they're like tricky. Um, something that has never happened before. Okay. T typical GDQ uh, phrase. <laughs> Um, th there's a, an extra room here that I'll always check, and there, it, there's always been like coins or enemies in there, but never a red coin ever. Maybe first time. So you're gonna check, right? Yeah, I, I always check it because I don't want to go back down here if I don't have to. Oh wow, this God. is the place to be. <laughs> it's happening here. That's kind of scary. <laughs> that is scary. We might. It happens like every run that I grab a star on accident. They're just in the way. So you're saying it's not going to happen here? Exactly. Okay. <laughs> There's more. There's even more stars. <laughs> Wait, is there like four in here? Yeah. <laughs> Goodness. Okay, I don't. I don't know if any of you guys saw the uh, the red coin star spawner. I didn't see it. Okay, that's probably nope. means we're done. Don't. But if I did see it, it would be cheating to tell you. No, yeah, it's basically okay. it simple's be. fault if I have to come back down here now. I'm glad it's not my fault. <laughs> okay. <laughs> tell you for sure it's not Kanasaki's fault because they donated four hundred dollars wow thing and here we go again there's a shadow and here we go again 500 wear for Ryu and his world and now 400 we all now we all now we want to have a 121 stars going let's go with an emote <laughs> thank you for the confusing donation <laughs> Yeah, it happens all the time where I just do my my regular movement and there's just a star in the way and I'm like, great. <laughs> so the blue coin's always in the same spot then? Blue coin's are randomized, yeah. Okay. Okay, nothing was on the other side. Right. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah, I've, I've jumped into a star like this before because you couldn't see it. There's the last one. And it spawns in the red coin room. All right, just two coins. There's probably two more coins here, right? Famous last words. <laughs> yeah, you would hope. <laughs> With an $18 donation, Dance Dad wants all of the stars to be found. Keep on grooving all. That was all right. Every, any HMC 100 where you don't have to aimlessly look around what you missed uh, is a good one. <laughs> Will the stars that you found move again when you come back? Uh, sometimes there, it's, a, it's a glitch, though. It's not supposed to happen, but uh, okay. it, it does happen every now and then in, uh, in Rainbow Ride, I think. It's, uh, it's, they still haven't figured out how to uh, fix that one. But I, I'm ready for that. I'm ready for that. <laughs> All right. Yeah, very long stuff. Oh, okay, that's new. That's a new toad. Because we, we're at 12 now. So that's the correct one. We don't have to look for him. So the toads give the stars, but they randomly put them in different They are, like, positions. all over the place. Oh, okay. yeah. All right. Yeah, the door is not open. Uh, we'll just have to exit. Oh, you can't exit a door if it, like, has requires too many stars or whatever? Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. 11 more for this one. Um, we did wing cap already, so we wouldn't see the light. Ah, there you go, it's open. Yeah, this light here is wild. The coins are like all over the place <laughs> when we do 100 coins. Oh my. Sometimes there is like a, a sign just in the middle of this bridge and it pushes you off and you're dead. I've died so many times to bonking into signs on slides. <laughs> Goes all the way up there. <laughs> yeah, HMC is off. Uh, CCM is awful because you have to climb a lot to get back to the stars. Oh, 
That's pretty good, though. That's good. I want to remind everybody that while we're working towards that 120 star incentive, that is just about $2,500 away. We're also very close to hitting $125,000 for the total. So let's please make that happen with donations like $25 from Avuki. Says, wait, the Chrism on the sticks and the j -Hobs on the mic? How could I not donate? Get those 120 stars, please. Okay, I have to find the uh, the pink bottom here to open the cannon, and he could be anywhere. Oh, there he is. <laughs> So we can actually do this stage first try. So, sometimes I have to enter this five times because I just couldn't find the game. Yeah. <laughs> wow. <laughs> awesome. And then based on where the spawner is, um, I might want to go for the higher coins first or the low coins first. Once ever, I did this entire stage cannonless. It just all worked out and it was fantastic. Wow, those bottom coins are <laughs> awful. There's no no wing cap up here. Great. That's why I came up here for it. Oh, no. We'll have to renew it somewhat soon. Let's get that one, too. Hopefully I don't die. Okay, I think they're right under this platform. Oh my god, they're very low, actually. Yeah, <laughs> surprisingly low. Oh my god. All right. <laughs> oh, now we gotta go all the way back up. Yeah, it's one more cannon shot. And because I'm terrified, I'm gonna renew my wing cap again. Yeah, dying in a randomizer is so much worse than dying in vanilla SM64 because you'd have to travel all the way through the castle just to get back to the level where you where you died in. So I really, I really try not to. <laughs> all right, done with that stupid level. Thank you. Rainbow Ride uh, is very special. <laughs> there is a, a carpet ride. I just saw a red coin fall. <laughs> a red coin fall? <laughs> yeah, I sure. hope not. It was the spiny. <laughs> okay. I, can't, I couldn't see a star there. Oh, my there is one. Okay, we'll go for this one. And open the box. There's four boxes in Rainbow Ride. One of them has a star. Okay. Uh, well, again, <laughs> first try everything. <laughs> we'll take it. <laughs> yeah, the other three have one up, so we just don't even open them. I like that I get applause for like getting lucky. It's great. I mean, <laughs> it's a momentous occasion. I know, I know. <laughs> Got to clap for RNG and clap for Dakar, who sent fifty dollars to Able Gamers and says you guys are awesome. There's two again. boxes. <laughs> There's two boxes in JRB. One of them has a star. So we nailed that one first try, too. You're just going to do everything first. <laughs> I'm just so good at guessing, man. <laughs> and I, I, for real, have never played this seat before, by the way. Uh -huh. It uh -huh. might not seem like that. Okay. All right, we're going to do Dark World Reverse. I hate that. Usually I start from the bottom. I love the stage backwards. <laughs> Okay. Just having a party there. Sometimes there's a coin on the flamethrower, and it's very scary. Not a big platform to be standing on. And the star is next to the pipe, right? Of course. <laughs> it's almost. Oh, listen, if they're going to make you get all the star like coins right there, they're going to make you travel. That's why I don't like doing Dark World or Fire Sea backwards, because it's always easier to jump down than it is to climb back up. Get that one up. 
in case we die eight times. That was on purpose, by the way. <laughs> I could say that any time and look like uh, it's the perfect run. No, but I first time entering Dark World, I uh, I die in it, so I can. All right, plan. Star. I can uh, <laughs> check out what it is right away. <laughs> so the way the time moving in TTC works is it remembers what you entered it with. So if we make the time stop now, and the next time we'll enter Dark World, it'll be time stopped. <laughs> There's only one box in this one. <laughs> There's only one box in this one, yeah. 20 wing cap. CCM. Slide should be open at 20. Four more, never mind. Let's just do this again. I would like to find uh, Dai Dai Docks so I can open whatever the fire sea entrance leads to. Okay, do you remember all the stars? I sure do. There was one up here and all the others down low. You gotta like remember so much. <laughs> I'll take Toad with me. Oh, good one. Or you could take Toad with me. No, no, no. <laughs> I'm just being... There's two penguins. Um, they both look identical. One of them is gonna. Oh, there's one. All right. We'll just take this one. One of them is gonna give us a star. It's a little bit of a pain. Is that a pun? <laughs> a, pe a penguin? A pain. <laughs> oh, he warped. He... Hey. All right, here we go. It's just a mean spot to put a penguin. Okay. Always have a lookout for the other one already. Oh. Okay, can we first try this one too? I haven't seen the other one yet. It's first try. Of course. <laughs> uh, Ellie, everything's gonna be first try. Where did that go? What? It's wall cake still working. Wall cake? Oh, okay. okay, okay. I did, oh man, I was looking at the track. <laughs> yeah. Simple flips, you're not supposed to help one. Oh yeah. <laughs> no, 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 thanks. This is actually, this doesn't count anymore. <laughs> okay. I'll submit co-op. Oh, okay. There's the other penguin. I'm so glad it wasn't that one. <laughs> <laughs> it is possible to get them over there, but very slow. Wait, are you serious? Yeah. It, it went to wall kicks? Yeah, it was up there. Why did you think he was lying? Well, where is it, Simple? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I see it. You know that spot from uh, Kaizo? Yeah. Oh my <laughs> god, <laughs> that's pretty bad. How, and you, you're telling me Arthur did this, all right. <laughs> you can do this. He's a legend. <laughs> awesome. You would have been dead if you fell, right? <laughs> yeah, I think yeah, so. pretty much. <laughs> okay, that's an exit again. I think we're going to need more stars like that one, aren't we? <laughs> we're going to need 120 <laughs> stars, people. Come on. We are just under $2,000 away, and we're so close to $125,000 in that total with donations like $100 from Anonymous. So did somebody say 120 star randomizer? I also have $10 from what is going on? They asked, I missed the explanation of this randomizer. Would you mind repeating the rules? Thank you. Um, yeah, simple. Why don't you go for that? Oh, great. <laughs> <laughs> okay, just correct me when and if I'm wrong. Oh, I'm dead. I think I'm actually dead, yeah. Uh, all loading zones lead to a random stage. You load into a stage at a random position of the stage. All stars are moved randomly. The conditions for them are the same, but the things you need to complete the conditions are random, so you should just aim wondrously. For <laughs> wondrously. 
and uh, enemies. Enemies, coins, stars, boxes. Yeah, every uh, warp yeah. zones, all, all random. If you think it's random, it probably is. Okay, so we're done with Tick Tock Clock now. And our slide opens at one more star, so we'll just get another one in CCM. And how does top look like? Rainbow Ride is a stage, Tick Tock Clock. Okay, top, top floor is perfect. So basically, um, since the top floor in vanilla, is one sta uh, two stages and one secret stage, it would be perfect and wouldn't require any extra travel if it's the same in Randomizer. So in this case, um, TikTok Clock is a secret stage, but Rainbow Stage and Rainbow Ride are stages. So we'd never have to like exit or travel upstairs extra, and that's, that's really good. And then earlier when we discovered that HMC is a, is a secret stage and Shifting Sandland, that's bad. That means we have to exit from the bottom floor uh, like a lot, <laughs> like mm. 10 times. But exiting is always better than traveling up the castle. Yeah, this star is also like a little bit on the edge uh, for 70 star. I go for it sometimes just because the star spawns right next to you, but the slide itself is very slow. All right. If you got more donations. Are we at 120 yet? We are almost there. Not <laughs> quite, though. We do have a $50 donation from Cam115. It says, hello, first time donator here. I've watched GDQ for years and finally have the means to give it back. Great job to all the staff and the runners for providing such a great experience for a good cause. Also have $25 from Dr. Doc. It says, first time donating for GDQ. Love the work Able Gamers is doing. Yeah, you, you always want to, if you want to play really safe, you want to enter the volcano with full HP because sometimes you spawn in the in one of those flamethrowers and they push you. <laughs> First you get hit by that flame and then you fall down and get hit by that flame and then you're dead. So when I do 100 coins, I, I'll make sure I have full HP going in, in the volcano. Okay. All right. In TTM, if I have the choice, between star number one and any other star, I go for star number one because that will enable the monkey on top of the mountain. So stuff like that I keep in mind. Um, just so if I spawn at the top, I can actually do the monkey star. Oh my god, all of the stages in the basement are secret so far. Okay. Oh, no. Yeah, I saw that one. I'm gonna get that on the way back. Andrew O donates ten dollars. He says, thanks for introducing me to the wonders of randomizers. Let's go for all the stars. Yeah. <laughs> we should. Party Frilla donates $20, says yes, no comment. I, I don't know if that's true. Here we go. Oh, that is unfortunate. I do hope that DDD, DDD is a stage. I hope Fire is a stage too, so we can at least travel there um, without exiting. Oh, I keep doing this. Yeah, I mean, well, I guess we're doing that now. <laughs> Snowman's Night Warps for Fire Sea. Um, might want to enter. Okay. Um, oh boy, long star. Here we go. Bit of a scary one. I'm trying to find the uh, the shell as well to help me out here because there's a lot of coins on the lava. With ten dollars, Sushi Elemental wants to know: Hey, why is Luigi wearing red? So random. 
I'll take that one. I'll take that one. I'm not going to bail on five coins. Oh, that was scary. Oh, oh my God. Okay, I'm not going to get that eyeball, I don't think. Um, you know, yeah, I'll just get this coin and these five. Because the eyeball is kind of important. Oh, I didn't realize it was an eyeball one. 43. I want to enter the pyramid, uh, the volcano with at least 77. Oh my god, dude. Okay. Oh my god, there's the jump box. Skylar donated $25. So I'm late to this GTQ, but hope my small donation helps for the 120 stars. And with that, we just passed $125,000 in donations for Able Gamers, everybody. Yes. I've got a new challenge for everybody out there. Our record for GDQX last year was actually $139,000 for the total. So let's push past that and make this a brand new total for GDQX. Okay, I said at least 77, but that's way too scary for a marathon run, so I'm getting more. <laughs> 79 is fine. Hey, that worked. That, did. <laughs> that worked. <laughs> I wasn't sure that was going to work either. If you slide kick on the lava um, and your bounce is like shortly after, you actually don't take damage and you get a bounce on the lava. That guy was here earlier. He just jumped off. Eh, <laughs> it happens. All right, nice. That was all right. And we're done with the volcano now, yes. Yeah, I have to find DDD. Weren't we in Total Mountain earlier? How did we get there? I think it was this. Was it? Yeah. Oh, it was. All right. <laughs> I actually did miss that then. Oh my god, all the red coins. Okay. I can do a little up warp here because water, bodies of water work really weirdly in Mario 64. Oh, invisible ceiling. <laughs> Something. Oh, just gonna do this one. I learned monkey glitch just recently, even though I've been running this game for five years now. <laughs> I still mess it up all the time. THI? Home Fortress. No. Snowman's in. Snowman's in. Let's go Snowman's in. Take Doc is loving all the Mario sounds because they donate $25. It says, Yahoo! Yahoo! Woohoo! <laughs> <laughs> I am not an Italian plumber. I'm sorry. <laughs> So in uh, in 70 star Womps Fortress, I start with 100 coins and then just grab any star that's closest after. And I don't go for red coins because the red coins are all over the place and sometimes in really, really bad ones. Very rarely that a red coin spawns on top of the mountain, so I'm just going to assume it's not on top there. <laughs> oh, all right. <laughs> but since this is 120 now... Well, I'm not yet. ...to like a wall. Just under $1,000 away from making it 120. Oh, oh almost. Let's okay, have those donations keep rolling in, people. Okay, just a little pause to check if there's a red coin above me. So much better than actually going up there and checking. Right, same here. You can check the slope if you pause right here. Wow. 
Oh, I'll die. You can get 10 coins from Womps if you... <laughs> <laughs> Flashback. I've had a Womp fam family uh, completely combo destroy me and I couldn't do anything. Uh, uh, okay. Yeah, just keep... Oh, I like it. Just, like, not gonna go on the ground. What? Oh, God, they're gonna combo me. <laughs> it's gonna happen again. All right. Oh, 100 already. I didn't even pay attention. Here we go. Down warp. Not quite. Not quite. Oh. Okay, yeah. Right next to the... Oh, I can show off the little warp then, I guess. It's probably a good option. Uh, so the warp points are never changed. Nope, never, warp points are the same. Okay. All right. <laughs> Snowman's land to Womp's fortress. This might be one big loop. The entire game might be one big loop. There's still a chance for that. If this is DDD, then it, the entire game is one loop. Well, there you go. <laughs> okay. It's not necessarily a good or bad thing, but uh, just pointing that out. You could enter every single level in a row if you just kept re-entering. All right, if you want to go for some more donations, go for it, please. Absolutely. Uh, Celticus with $100 is really liking when you do some climbing, because they said, I can't too, Mario. I'm sorry, everybody. <laughs> it was good effort. I appreciate it, Hobbs. That reminded me of that uh, scene in Finding Nemo where they uh, introduced him to the cult. <laughs> <laughs> I hope people know what I'm talking about. <laughs> also, pretty big update here. We're going to be doing 120 stars, everybody. Thank you for all the donations. Nice. And that is all thanks to everybody donating out there, but especially Andrew164, who threw in $1,000. Wow. No comment. Thank you so much. When you were in DDD, were you intentionally looking for... Start number one, yes. Okay. Um, I, I like to get... Uh, well, you should get star number one first, so you can enter Fire Sea. Because um, otherwise, Fire Sea won't be available. So now I know where, where everything is, and I can route around it. We found, we discovered every single stage. Uh, star, I mean. And stage. So that was just the closest one I could find, so we'll be in the bus now. So yeah, even though this is a seat that was tested, oh, stars can, the, the way stars spawn from like bosses, oh, it's not that one, it's that one. Um, it's completely random every time. So if I was gonna beat Womp King again, the star would spawn somewhere else. So if a star actually spawns in, an, in a spot that's too far out or out of reach, I just get a different one usually. All right, DDD100, more donations, please. <laughs> <laughs> Absolutely. $100 from Carl Zahn. They say, as always, an amazing or an awesome event by the GDQ community. Slap Daniels also threw in a $100 bill and said, we need more stars. 120 from Fructose Jaguar said, $120 for 120 stars. Also have $25 from Windslash. He says, shout outs to Simple Flips. Hey. Hey. Okay, I want to mention this. I think... You reached out to like a bunch of people about this, right? <laughs> yeah. At GDQ, like, like like four years four ago. years ago, and I was I the first one to do it. I think so. I think I I was the first one to give Simple Flips a shout out at GDQ <laughs> <laughs> because he just DM'd me right before my run and was like, "Hey, give me a shout out." <laughs> <laughs> well, we've got twenty five dollars from Obo Oz twenty two says Yahoo! Hi GDQ, cool to see Mario sixty four sound effects the game. Good luck on the run, Chrism, and shout-outs to Simple Flips. Money goes to the 120-star run. 
Uh, 32 coins is not a lot, but um, I'm going over. So Randomizer has a little extra coins added in, in some stages. For example, big example, uh, Jolly Roger Bay has only 104 coins in the original. But in Randomizer, that would mean a lot of coins would spawn out of bounds and make it impossible. So they added, I'm not sure how many, like there's like 120 total now. So it's much nicer. Oh yeah, something, sometimes something spawns in here, that's why I get the Vanish Cap too. Very rarely though. Right, I hope I found enough coins. Right, there's another five under me. Good for those. Oh, eight, even. nice. And Dodo donated $75. He said, GDQ events are always a blast, and Able Gamers is such a worthy cause. Good luck to 360 Chrism on the Mario 64 Randomizer 120 star run. <laughs> All right, we're missing nine yellow coins. Oh. I really hope I don't have to swim back for those. Yeah. I want to make sure everybody knows that with that 120 star incentive med, make sure you're now throwing your donations to the Resident Evil 2 Leon B standard uh, incentive that we actually just opened up pretty recently. That one is going to need $20,000 to get met, so let's make it happen. Oh my god, the camera is turning so slowly. Okay, four coins to go, and the, the blue coin switch. Oh, that's not good. I might have to swim back if I can't find it. Oh, yeah. The, oh, yeah. This jump is incredibly difficult, and I'm going to blame this, uh, the not familiar setup once, <laughs> maybe three times. Uh, oh, no. It sounds like you're making excuses. First oh, first Yeah. No. Yes. Nice. <laughs> Take a try. Let's go. <laughs> that is such a hard jump. For those at home who don't know, what is a first? Uh, it's a first frame wall kick. If you uh, get a wall kick on the very first frame, Mario keeps all of his speed that he had before. I'm actually swimming back. I haven't done this in ages. <laughs> oh, well. I got a little too confident with the amount of coins that I got in the first place. In DDD, you always spawn in the first area. Any particular reason why? Just because it's two different loading zones again. I hope this doesn't mess with the, the star. I think it's going to move, but it should still be fine. I think they fixed it, actually. Because I swam I swim back a, like a while ago and reported that the star was just gone. <laughs> okay, what I meant to say is I think I don't know anything, apparently. <laughs> <laughs> no, I think it may fix No, you played this game. It's just a new version. <laughs> oh, there's... It's, oh, my God, there's like another 13. All right, that was a little rough, but we'll take it. I'll still crush the estimate. I hope. <laughs> There's the confidence. VG's a fan of the water stages. They donated $100. Said, thanks to all the people who make these events possible. Good luck, Chris. P.S. I hope you enjoy Mario 64's very high-quality swimming. It is very high-quality. <laughs> I had a discussion with them the other day about how swimming in Mario games got worse every time. Mario 64 had, like, the best swimming. What if I drown? Great content. <laughs> okay. Fire Sea is Snowman. Yeah, we can actually just continue like a, a very big loop without having to travel extra. There is three boxes in Snowman's Land, and one of them has a star. Ah, oh. okay. <laughs> the streak is over. I just looked over at Dark Brain because I knew. <laughs> <laughs> You're not wrong. Or at least I thought I knew. <laughs> Wait, you thought it was going to happen again? Yeah. <laughs> Had to. Oh, that didn't work. All right. I'm trying to, to uh, duplicate the money bag and uh, crash the economy. Well, you know what won't crash the economy are more donations to Able Gamers, <laughs> like $25 from Audrey, who is out in the audience. So shout out to Simple Flips from the audience. <laughs> I 
$50 from Lovely Soft Snow. So it's just here to donate what I can to a charity that helps those who need it. Shout out to Half Coordinated. Come on, <laughs> give me a few more. There you go. That's a lot. It's okay, the game won't crash until like 50 of them. It's just that that's about 20 extra coins that is just gonna help me and I don't have to look around very much. Is there anything like that you can and can't do in a randomizer? Like in terms of like glitches or anything like that? No. In, one, in 120 star is just glitches. I guess in 70 star we would not allow BLJ. Yeah. Yeah. But it's 120 star now, so we can do whatever we want. I'm I guess officially cloning stars wouldn't be allowed, mm. but that's not really viable. Non-task. We had a bunch of donations before we met that incentive, like $50 from Sweaty Gazelle said $50 for 50 stars. Zilky with $30 said 120 stars now. Littlest Minish with $25 says 120 stars. And Ike with $25 said let's get that 120 stars. Thank you all for your donations. Get it. Yeah, I found all red coins. One of them is in a really bad spot up the snowman. I like to get the, the wing cap in here, just so I can move freely. At the bench cap. Get in there. <laughs> okay. No. I just wanted those Land, coins. Yeah, yeah, actually. Calculated. calculated. <laughs> eh. Oh, was it right there? No. Why can't I not do this here? <laughs> this is just RNG manipulation. Don't worry about it. Okay. Yeah, it's right here. I thought it was on the other side. Oh. Twenty dollars from Walk Skyluker. This has got to donate for more Chrism. Oh, and hundred twenty stars is nice too. <laughs> and Journeyman donated fifty dollars earlier. It's fifty dollars towards fifty stars. It's Simple calculus. <laughs> All right. Sweet. Yeah, my hand always goes to the tracker after every star, even though there's no nothing to be tracked anymore. Okay, since we had 35 total stars now, I'm looking for Toad, and I'm done looking for Toad in Snowman's room. <laughs> All right, good search. Hey, it's nice to get a star of like five seconds. <laughs> Pop2 donated $20 and said, had to donate a second time when I heard about that PS4. That's right, everybody. There are a lot of prizes that you could be entered in the drawing to win. So be sure to check out gamesdonequick.com, throw in a donation, and look at the prizes that you can get entered in to win. <laughs> yeah, now we're just going. But I, uh, based on my spawn, I decide what star I go for. Um, and that's, that's about it. Uh, there's always like a best option. I do like doing Ghost Hunt early in BBH though. Just so the, the carousel in the bottom is available for 100 coins and the star itself. Does your spawn change every time you enter a painting or, you know, enter a new level, or is it...? Yeah, every time you enter, it's completely random again. Yeah. 
Why is that one so high? Oh my god, I have to wait for him, alright. To check the, the roof at the meantime. Um, that was that three? Yeah, okay. So I got I got a route, I go for it. I do this, like this little loop so I can see the lobby because that's a pretty big spawn point. And then uh, I go to the roof right after. And then I check the, all other rooms before I jump in the basement because basement is the, the slowest place. I can also do a little trick here, look in the room. Okay, I didn't see anything when I uh, used first person. There's the boss. Camera doesn't turn uh, on the roof, it's, it's all automatic, so I have to wait for the slow camera turn. All right, two to go. <laughs> two boos to go, hopefully I don't have to go in the basement. Um, I did see a boo in the basement earlier, but maybe it's one of the... You're absolutely right. There was one next to the star. Yeah, that's the one, that's the right one. So, the, in original um, Mario 64, there's six boos, and five of them are correct. One of them is a bait, I don't know why. <laughs> um, and in randomizer, they removed the sixth one. Oh, okay. So I didn't that know is that. that is the right one. There's a red coin here. Great. Okay. Yeah, the star is awful. <laughs> you gotta go all over the. Place. So the boss is completely random where he spawns. Yep, the the boss is in a random location too. Nice. And then after that, the star as well. <laughs> Did we see the red coin spawner? I don't know. I wasn't paying attention for okay. that. I didn't see it downstairs. That's all, that's all that matters, really. What is that shadow? Terrifying. <laughs> and then, same again. I'll check outside first. It's the biggest spawn area. And then roof. The lobby roof. There he is. Oh, all right. Thank you. <laughs> That's pretty lucky. Here we go. Agent Otter donated ten dollars and said, "Here's ten dollars to help keep GDQX running as long as possible." Let's -a go, one twenty. <laughs> <laughs> You're right, J Hobbs. I might have done too much karaoke the other <laughs> night. <laughs> I think my voice is pretty broken too. Okay, we're looking for the uh, box star or the king. King preferably. Can't see him anywhere. There's the box star. There's only one box here, so. We'll just say first try. <laughs> first try. Oh my god. <laughs> wow. Here we go. Yeah, you need to beat the king first before you can race Koopa. So I, if you have the choice, you should beat the, uh, the king first. What a spawn. All right. <laughs> Imagine. <laughs> I'll just get this one. Yeah, there's... I'm not sure how many exactly. It's a lot, though. There's probably, like, another 10 boxes and one of them has a star that we don't have yet. Okay, which dry world is Vanish. Which is actually great to die in, um, to come back outside. So I think that's a little faster than exiting and then walking out the castle. Okay. We do have 100 coins here already, and we know all other stars are lower, so... That sign is in an awful spot. <laughs> Another thing that's randomized that we'll almost never see is all sign text boxes are random as well. So you could you could get a, a text box from a boss when you talk to a sign. Anonymous donated $25, said, I had to donate one more time for Super Mario 64. 
$50 from Bizlev with the comment here, take my money. Okay, fires. So every time we leave Lethal Lava Land, I'll be walking to Fire Sea. That's my route right now. I think that makes the most sense. Yeah, that's unfortunate with Kuku Mountain as well. Just gonna exit. We're, we're gonna have to exit stages probably about 20 times in this one. How would you say, like, for luck, is that like an average? That's, yeah, that's normal. Oh, okay. CCM 100, also a weird one. All right, we're gonna decline the race. And then just go. But not fast, because there's more coins than this. This one blue coin should be sacrificed, and it's worth it before all the other coins around here. Yeah, there's so many. Oh my god. There's plenty in CCM, though. I always try to turn the camera here, but I can. Just mash the C-stick. Is it like actually possible to read that sign on the slide? No. <laughs> There's no way. <laughs> Just chill on that. Depends what part of the slide it's on, but mm. almost impossible, certainly. Mystery Mitri donated $25. Says, I've only been in the crowd for about 20 minutes, but watching this randomizer run from Chrism has actually inspired me to attempt speedrunning Mario in the future myself. Donation incentive is runner's choice. Oh yeah, we'll we'll handle runner's choice uh, next. I actually don't know what's still open. Uh, right now, there's only one uh, challenge open, and that would be Resident Evil 2 Leon B Standard for that Resident Evil 2 run coming up at the end. There are a couple bid wars as well. The Resident Evil 2 soundtrack choice between the classic and the remake, and the Resident Evil 2 costume tr costume choice with a few different options there. Okay, I'll check that out after. <laughs> Ash9196 donated $120 earlier, saying 120 is the number we want to see. Chris Crab, go Chris, go Chris <laughs> Crab. Okay, 92 to go. Three red coins. I'm not sure if I remember seeing one at the Wall Kicks Will Work area. Do you? <laughs> I was racking the brain, I'm not sure. No comment. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> sure. Oh, right. I think so. I think I, I remember at least one there. In case we die with too many coins, I'm going to finish up 100s right now. So we don't have to do that anymore. And I guess we'll check out the wall kicks area. Or the slope, actually. We'll do the slope after. There's a shadow. I don't know what that is. Yeah, there's a wreck on here. Told you. <laughs> <laughs> okay, dude. <laughs> oh yeah, now I can show you guys how how to get back from this area without the cannon. So if I was ha if I had to bring that penguin back, we would have to take the penguin on a journey. 
over this slope. <laughs> you know, I think we had a donation like that earlier. <laughs> Hey, yeah. I'm actually just going to finish up CCM now because it goes through the wing cap. Um, and I'm going to forget about it. And since I died in, did, since I did a tactical uh, death in TTC earlier, we can actually enter that last and we'll be in the tippy area uh, and done. That's going to be the last star I'll be grabbing. Snowman is also the same, you can't really randomize its path. Alright. Yeah, if you have any more donations, go, just go for it whenever. Sure thing. Funcron donated five dollars to Able Gamers, said knowing games are getting done quick makes it easier to sleep at night. Great playthrough and for such a good cause. Ten dollars from incredible Bleedable egg. Incredible edible egg, that's what it is. <laughs> $10 from him. Uh, and they say, hey chat, are you ready to start a $10 donation train? Let's go! Let's do it. Let's get those $10 in everybody. Remember, we're going to try to push past $139,000 as our big total for this event, which would surpass last year's GDQX. I would love to see that happen. Hey, everybody out there, would you love to see more money for Able Gamers? Yeah? Woo! <laughs> I thought so. Okay, so we are done with CCM now. Galaxy's Quest donated $10, and they're hoping for that PS4. Great movie, by the way. We also have a $50 donation from a rolling wheel. They say, awesome to see GDQ in my hometown. Let's get those 120 stars. Okay, since, since we're here right in front of LLL, I'm gonna make sure to catch that MIPS. All right, I think the toad pushed me out of, no, out of the path. <laughs> it's okay, we have to come a couple more times. I'll get him later. Every time, man. <laughs> There's nothing I can do. It just wants to be friendly. Okay. Two more boxes here, right? And that's the one. Okay. So is there only one box there, or is there more than one? There's one star box, one shell, and one one up. Okay. That so was the second one we opened. All right. That's true. Only second try. This only one. second try. This oh, well. Detective Chai donated $10 earlier. They said, just realized GDQX was on in time for my first video game ever. Let's get that 120 stars. It's not quite how you remember it. <laughs> I mean, the stars are there, the coins are there, the <laughs> bosses are there. It's, it's all the same, right? More swimming means more time to hear from Jordan247, who donated $10, saying they are loving the SM64 randomizer run. Put this towards Leon B for Resident Evil 2. Oh yeah, the chests have numbers now uh, in randomizer, since they're all over the place. Otherwise you would have to guess the order many, many times and take damage a lot before you knew. I played, I played vanilla SM64 the other day and I was freaking out that the numbers were missing everywhere. <laughs> okay, how's the pace doing? Yahoo! 
That's pretty good. I like to have about 60 stars at 1 hour 15. Oh, all right, we spawned down here. Oh, okay, I'll get the open star. That was... All right, see, BBH is one of those stages. Yeah, it's still broken. It moved, everything moved. So that red coin, the, the stars was gone. Uh, the red coin that was in the basement earlier, it might not be there anymore. That's really weird. Is that normal? It's, it's because of Ghost Hunt. Ghost Hunt changes the stage after you beat it because there's extra stairs. Right. And yeah, it just messes with it. That's why I usually go for it first and then learn the level after, like where everything is. But it's all right, we'll, we'll find everything, I'm sure. Seems like there's so much to remember in this randomizer. Like, what do you, like, prioritize? What do I prioritize? Yeah, like, what do you, like, try to, like, remember the most? Because, I mean, you can't, like, remember everything, right? Yeah, it's hard to, to remember, like, every single red coin I've seen. Right. And so I, I usually just focus on the stars. Okay. Oh, no. Author, what did you give me? <laughs> <laughs> So what I have to do is I have to... Oh, this is a great time for donations, yeah. <laughs> I have to be very fast to actually get him up there. Sure thing, $15 from Anonymous says, Awesome Games! That's too slow. Also, Kedidin Turbo donated $25 and said, Amazing run, amazing runner. May the odds be with you for this 120-star oh. run. <laughs> That's the fastest I've ever seen anyone match. It wasn't good enough. <laughs> No, he jumped again. No. Oh, so he resets every time he jumps. Oh my god, please. Can we butt slide? Okay, great. Now, now we got him. <laughs> we just have to wait for him to walk up here. <laughs> because if he goes lower than his original spawn, he'll jump back up. But he can go up as, as far as he likes. Oh. There's like boulders around as well. You know, you just walk over here. <laughs> there we go. Now we gotta go. We got a lot of people getting in on that $10 donation train. Soma Soda said, uh, cool cat in chat, $10. Pablo202, $10. Choo choo, thanks, GDQ. Billiard donated $10 so GDQ continues to be an amazing event for wonderful causes. Thanks to all the participants. And another $10 from Mr. Harvey is that joining on the $10 train. Also donating for Leon B because who doesn't love B memes in Resident Evil 2 Remake? As well as the extra boss G5? Is it this one? Okay. Nice. We opened only three boxes and we found all stars. This is amazing. <laughs> but uh, I would open many more anyway for the 100 coin uh, star. There's a lot of coins in boxes. How does the water work in this level? It's always at the bottom. Okay. In randomizer, it's always at the bottom, no matter how you enter. Oh. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> Where do you end up if you die from fall damage? In the vanish cap? Yeah. <laughs> okay. I think. Oh, I think you would fall out of the. Uh, you would be in the moat. Yeah, you would. We would be in the moat. And you would lose a life. I've never. I've never died to fall damage. Really. Oh, this one. Yeah, the pace is actually pretty good. I think some of the 100 coin stars were a bit meh, like the DDD one. But uh, pace seems to be alright. Yeah. Vicarious Vice donated $25 and said, Shout outs to Winslash for giving shout outs to Simple Flips earlier. <laughs> also, shout outs to Simple Flips. Thank you. Get out. You're stealing my thunder. <laughs> <laughs> oh. $100 from Anonymous with no comment, but thank you for the donation. 
you want to... Oh, all right. So assume anything that has like the star glowy thing is like part of an objective, right? Oh yeah, yeah. Um, there's three bullies out of however many in this level that are required for the second boss. And they, they sparkle so you can identify them. You gotta do the trick. Yeah, I, I'll, I'll do it. I'll do it. <laughs> that was a first to you. So these these ledge grab tricks don't work if you get a first try, a first frame wall kick. Oh my god, please. Nice. nice. Got a few more passengers on the $10 train. We got Noah Sterneman donated $10. This is for the sheriff outfit of Resident Evil so we can find Carl. 10 from Dane Slave said if everyone in chat ships another 10 bucks, we'd be way over the 150,000 point. Just saying. And 10 from Hotaro Hinu who said $10 because why not? I agree with that one. <laughs> $20 from Night Slayer says, as a disabled gamer myself, how could I not donate? And $25 from KGT says, been trying to donate more each year. Thanks to all the runners for everything you do. Nice. Okay. Saved it. <laughs> so that you kind of have like, you know, you know like exactly where you need to go at this point. Aside from like... Uh, stars that you want to like lead to other objectives? Are you just like kind of just getting the fastest stars or? Yeah, whatever I remember closest. Okay. Like for other like people or like, you know, do they like want to like prioritize, like, does it make sense to like prioritize like a hundred like coin stars or something like that or it just doesn't really matter? No, it doesn't really matter. Okay. Here we go. I mean, if you really want to go for a, a personal best, um, it's generally better to go for the harder stars first, so you know you're not wasting time and lose a run later to a hard star. Sure. But other than that, it doesn't really matter. In DDD, for example, if I spawn right next to a coin ring, I'll just do 100 coins. Okay. Except I always star one first, so right. so fire sees open. It really comes down to the stage. No matter where I spawn, star number one in DDD first. Okay. Our Gitlam donated another $25, saying also because I forgot to say it last time, honk. <laughs> A lot of people playing Untitled Goose Game, I suppose. <laughs> yeah. Yo, we've got Dave Stereo donating $10, saying shout outs to Darkman. Oh, and Chrism. <laughs> oh, and Simple Flips. <laughs> oh, and J Hobbs. <laughs> Thanks, Dave. Dave's on the tech, by the way. So everyone, to Dave. everyone's stealing the thunder now. <laughs> oh, yeah. See, that's why we do ghost hunt first. I can just go for this star now. It 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 did seem like oh, that's not the right one. It did seem like there were red coins down here. So, regardless, I'll have to be down here and up again. Yeah, that's normal. <laughs> it's really bad when it goes all the way to the roof from the basement. Broken donated $50, said stars, orbs, 125,000. Let's -a go. Also, Tom B with $25. They said, always enjoy watching these events. Here's to 120 stars. Here we go. Hmm. 
I'm trying to figure out how to solve the JRB room. Oh, it seems every time we enter Rainbow Ride... Oh, the JRB room has one secret and one stage. And in, in this randomizer right now, Aquarium is a stage and Jolly Roger isn't. So that room is just perfect as well. We don't have to, have to extra travel. It's always good when this works out like that. All right, B.O.B. 100, so another super slow star. <laughs> I hope we have enough donations for this. Well, I think we're going to need a few more $10 donations to add <laughs> on to that train. Like ones from Hey208 says, have a good day. And Hustleberry, who also donated $10, said, let's add the 50 stars. And we got $10 from Cosmic Floyd, who says, donating for a great cause always warms my heart. Watching these speedrunners inspires me to become one myself. You should do it. It's easy. It's easy to start. You just put on a timer, start the game, and you're in it. <laughs> we don't even need a timer, technically. You just need to play fast. You, know? you can always time it after. $100 came in from Scott M. Said, call this an express checkout. And $50 from Oatmeal said, must get the 120 stars. Look like we're just over halfway through now. did want to remind everybody what you're donating for. Able Gamers is a fantastic charity. There are millions of people with disabilities who can't play video games without expensive specialized equipment. The Able Gamers charity helps gamers with disabilities by providing that equipment free of charge. Their mission is to create opportunities that enable play in order to combat social isolation, foster inclusive communities, and improve the quality of life for people with disabilities. So thank you for donating to Able Gamers. All right, that just <laughs> the pink, the pink bomb just killed uh, the black one. <laughs> Have you opened the cannon here already? No, I don't really need it. Um, I did check the island earlier when I was on the mountain, and there's nothing except the secret up there. Uh, okay. Oh, and then we have a wing cap. We don't need really need that. That's fair. Okay, that's the last one already. Yeah, that was good. Where are the coins? <laughs> oh, while you're looking for them, I want to remind folks, make sure you're getting those donations in for the Resident Evil 2 Leon B standard donation incentive. We got $50 from Cowboy Chemist, who seems to be a fan, saying, been lurking for a long time. Glad to donate to such a great cause. This one goes out to Sheriff Leon. Okay, what I like to do is when I can't find the coins is I go high and uh, fly around the edges really fast. Oh. Might run out of wing cap before, yeah. I can do that. This slope is a popular spawn place. All right, not today. Okay, there's two more next to the king. We could get those if we're really in need. There's, there's the coin. Oh my god, they're all on the edge. <laughs> Yeah, the render distance isn't very far, so you actually have to get kind of close to them. Oh my god. Oh, all right. And then I'll get the last Goomba, and we're good.
We got a bunch of people adding onto that $10 donation train now. $30 from Anonymous. That's tens, tens, tens across the board. $10 from Abilit, who says, all on board the hype train. Choo-choo! Chris Janis donates $10, says, these level layouts are blowing my mind. <laughs> $10 from Clever Username it says, here's to beating last year's record. Oh, we don't want to hit that water level. Sacred Spoon and the $10. $10 train, choo choo. And then Windslash comes back with another $25 donation. It's so a shout outs to Vice for shout outs to myself who shouted out <laughs> Simple Flips. Shout out to Simple Flips. <laughs> Thank you, Windslash. <laughs> Listen, if you two keep going back and forth, I'll just keep reading them. That's, that's all I'm going to say. <laughs> How long do you think we can get? What's the character limit? <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, I think this is going to be the last star in HMC as well, so we don't have to die intentionally. <laughs> nice. Well, that's going to be it. Yeah, if they're down here, it's usually easier. And let's go to the vanish card. $50 come to uh, Able Gamers from King TDN. They say, insert generic comment here. $25 from Anonymous. We are all made of stars. I know you are, Hobbs. I think you're a star, Dark Man. Oh, thank you. But not as big of a star as another Anonymous $50 donator. Says, let's see the 120 stars. I was hoping Chaps would say not as big as Chrism, but it's <laughs> I thought about it. I was actually like two seconds away from <laughs> saying Chrism. I thought, nah, we got bigger stars donate donating out there. <laughs> $25 come to us from Neo Techno. It says choo choo. Another 25 from Jabuffalo with the same comment. A lot of people jumping onto that donation train. And thank you for everybody throwing, even, oh, throwing in even more than $10 to help out the people who can't throw their tens in. Like T Bone Malone donates $30 saying, Yeah, yeah, Yahoo! <laughs> Is it okay if I donate more than $10? Of course it's okay. Okay, there's one more open star. I do not remember where that is actually. Ugh. Oh, I remember where it is. <laughs> no, you don't. <laughs> Good call. <laughs> I remember. Wait, do you actually? <laughs> I don't know. You'll never know because I'm never going to tell you. I didn't know. It was right there. No, no, there's another one outside. That's, <laughs> the, <laughs> that's the one we were talking about. I don't actually know if you saw it. Uh, oh, yeah, I remember. <laughs> Can't tell if it's a bait or not. <laughs> <laughs> he's just going to say, yeah, was like, yeah, yeah. When yeah, I get yeah. it, he's like, oh, yeah, it was there. I'll tell you later. <laughs> oh, hello. <laughs> nice catch. And that's it for Worm's Fortress. There's a $10 donation from D-Ray3. It says, shout out to Hello Planet as she's been streaming this nonstop while studying for med school.
Speaking of shoutouts, we got $50 from Kelsey, who says, shoutouts to Spike Vegeta's hair, Covert Muffin's laugh, Half Coordinated's inspiration, and all the GDQ events I've enjoyed for years now. Much love to everyone involved. I think somehow there was actually three people who were not here. <laughs> yeah. We still appreciate them, though. Absolutely. Alright, 100 coins here. Tobias contributes $10 and says the $10 train must roll. Asterisk also chipped in a $10 bill, saying shoutouts to Shenanigans for being in the audience. What? I can't believe he abandoned you, dude. Just sat on the couch <laughs> right? instead of coming here. Notorious DLC donated $20 and said, Happy to donate to such a great cause and help everyone gain access to video games. Shout out to Simple Flips, my friends in TDS, and to 360 Chrism for being able to follow the nonsense that is SM64 Randomizer. Thanks for a great run. Thank you to Roger for your $50 donation. He says, thank you, friends. All right, we don't need the bus. I didn't even spawn. That could be a 10 coin box. Never mind. There's two boxes in uh, BBH. One of them has a one-up and another one ten coins. Or it might be a three-coin box too. I'm not sure. We have ten dollars from Lantic138. Says here's ten dollars to suplex the train. Wait, that's not the train we're talking about. In that case, put this towards Sheriff Leon. As well as ten dollars from Snugglebus says video games are my favorite hobby, and I love what able gamers do to share them with everyone. Tom E agrees with their ten dollar donation, saying great run for a great cause. Can't see. I should kill that. So I messed up. Uh, if you want to have a good camera in on the top of the BBH castle. You need to enter the front door with Mario Cam C down. And then it'll stay good. But now that I didn't do that, it's gonna look like this. And it's really rough. Or, or this only. Oh, there's of course so many coins up here. Oh no. Yeah, I'll just, I'll just go around. Sigpipe donated thirty dollars. Said video games are an important part of my life, and I'm happy to support an organization that makes it possible for others to experience the games many of us take for granted. Let's keep the ten dollar train going. Nice, it's right here. Oh, don't let's not fall down. <laughs> yeah, that was a weird camera angle. Sometimes when you grab a star, uh, spawn a star, the camera angle just completely changes because of the star's camera. And, and I'm not ready for it. Oh. A little dark, hard to see. All right, we're, get, we're get actually done with most of the uh, super slow stars. Rainbow Ride is still a big mystery. We might have to ride the carpet. Or do carpetless, if we get lucky. Yeah, you could do that, right? <laughs> or just spawn on the house. That's also an option. 
Let's assume Keeper the Quake, it's always like the same path. Yeah, it's um. always. So while I do Koopa the Quick, I look out for the secrets. So there's one in this underpath. There's one on the island I know of. And they actually have maximum render distance, so you can see them uh, from the top as well. Yeah, you can see them, I, I guess. <laughs> Two, then one under. One on the island, that's four. We're missing one more. And then there's the other one next to the star. So now we just have to remember this for like 20 minutes and then come back. Again. No problem. <laughs> well, Sarsum remembers how to donate with $20, saying choo-choo. We also got $10 from Sam the Dancing Matzo Man. Says shout outs to Matzo and 360 Chrism <laughs> and <laughs> Simple Flips. Hey. <laughs> I like how Simple started laughing as soon as he said shout outs. <laughs> well, shout outs too, and he's already. <laughs> as soon as I heard uh, Sam the Dancing Matzo Man, I knew what it was. <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay. $10 from Not a Dog says bark the RNG away. And $10 from Scump says choo choo. Let's keep that train a rolling. Oh, since I spawned up here, I'm actually just gonna get the, the city star before 100 coins. So there's a really crazy scenario that can make a seat impossible where. There's a star inside, or a red coin, inside the, uh, the Vanish Cap cage. And then the Vanish Caps are n unobtainable because the water level can't be lowered low enough. It's like so many things have to go wrong for that to happen. And it did happen to me twice already. <laughs> <laughs> it's pretty rare nowadays though. Most seeds are actually completable. Oh, wait, what am I doing? Oh, I might as well go for red coins now. Then. Yeah, there's plenty of extra coins, so it won't matter when you do 100. Yeah, I just autopiloted to the red coins. So the red coins will always be in the town, right? Since yeah. Yeah, I think this is working out pretty nicely. When there's like 10 stars left, I have a full overview of like my, my final routing, basically. And if I, if I, pri I usually prioritize stages that are in the basement or the lobby, because I want, I want to be able to um, have an up warp at the very end, so I don't have to travel up the castle one extra time. That's like very minor improvement though. We had a few $25 donations all coming in a row. One from Jimbo175 who said, let's get that Leon B run. Moses526 says, thanks for bringing this event back to TwitchCon. It's a special experience to catch the event in person. And Ham Dinner with one of those $25 donations saying, Able Gamers is pretty rad. Boy, we got another donation from Vicarious Vice with $10 that says, Shout outs to Windslash, who gave shout outs to me when I gave shout outs to him when he gave shout outs to Simple Flips earlier. <laughs> also, shout outs to Simple Flips. <laughs> I can't find the last red coin. I want that to get long enough to where it is impossibly hard to follow. <laughs> It's easy enough for you, you can read it, but for them, this is a challenge. Yahoo! 
Do you guys remember where that last red coin was? Nope. Probably over yep. here. Yeah, I have a guess, yeah. It was going to be there. Oh. Oh yeah, there it is. It's really hard to see with the red background. There's a twenty-five dollar donation from Flying Snails. They said, "Haven't donated yet, so we hope this helps." Thanks to everyone for all that you do. And $25 from Chicken Tenderson says, put it towards Leon B. Any reason to donate is a great cause. Wahoo! That is a great <laughs> username. Chicken Tenderson. <laughs> yeah, loving it. $20 from Casey and Adam say, hey, Chris. Just got into your content recently, and we were so excited to hear about this run. Good luck and keep it up. Thanks to everyone involved at GDQ for another lovely event. Thank you very much. I'm trying to think. You don't remember where that star was. <laughs> of course I do. Darkman said I couldn't tell you. <laughs> I already, I already said that I don't know. So I, I admit that I was trying to bamboozle him. I have a guess, though. I think I'll miraculously remember where it was moments before you grab it. <laughs> what? That was my guess. Oh my god, okay, I see it. Uh, it is that number we just saw, literally. Right here. Am I crazy? <laughs> I can tell you if you want me to. <laughs> <laughs> what? I'm losing it. <laughs> You're fine. It's at the ego entrance, isn't it? No. Should we leave oh. it? Oh, there it is. I was going to say, should we leave it up to the donators for whether Simple Flips tells you or not? But <laughs> it looks like. If he said yes, I was going to say, Dark Man won't let me. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. Yeah, that's a tough spot. I can't. I can't. I'm doing the super tilt. Okay. There's a way to get there, though. It's so far out. This <laughs> is so bad. <laughs> <My God. laughs> Alright, 78, good number. Got a $10 donation from Demon Fire. It says, people keep shouting out Simple Flips, but I want to shout out 360 Chris. Heck yeah. For having Simple Flips on the couch so we can shout him out. I was baited so hard. <laughs> Dude, love what I was doing. I didn't mark it. Okay. <laughs> Ten dollars for minus corp it says awesome gameplays all the weekend. Thank you for everything. Thank you for your ten dollar donation. DDD is done too. Why two Gen and Glitch Ritual donated ten dollars? They said we love GDQ and are enjoying this wild Mario sixty four run so much. Thank you to everyone involved for another great event. Heart. Mm. 
Anonymous chipped in 50 bucks and said, where's my merry-go-round music only run incentive? Oh, no. <laughs> Really weird start position over here. No, and we're climbing again. All right, red coins. Uh, this is four red coins down here. If we can find all eight without having to look at on top of the castle, that would be fantastic. There's another one. Oh, that's five. Okay, so we saw six already. How bad can it get with the carpet? Like, how many times would you have to like ride it? I mean, worst case, you'd have to ride the curb five times, but <laughs> that's never really happened before. That's so bad. All right, how bad has it been for you? Three times. Okay. Pretty recently, I had to ride it three times. All right. Here we go. Yeah, it was, there was two stars up there and a red coin. So, wow. And I never spawned on top, so I just had to ride it over and over again. We're still missing both upstairs totes. They're just somewhere. And Osomo is starting to empty their pockets because they dropped $5 and said, okay, okay, one more donation. I really appreciate the choice of charity this year. I'm a disabled gamer myself, so I strongly appreciate the hobby to connect with others. Well done, all runners. Uh-oh, we've got a donation from Winslash. $25 that says, <laughs> shout outs to Vice, who shout out to myself, who shouted out Vice, who shouted out me for shouting out Simple Flips. Shout outs to Darkman and Chrism. Oh, and I guess shout outs to Simple Flips. <laughs> <laughs> this is great. Dan the Man Hoban with, donated $25 <laughs> that said, shout outs to Pineapple never being on pizza. Also, shout outs to Simple Flips. <laughs> Great name. <laughs> Fango donated ten dollars and said flip outs to simple shouts. There it is. Here we go. Okay, I'm assuming both toads are in here. <laughs> it's empty. Okay. That's like the biggest place. <laughs> I'll find them, I'll find them, I'll find them. Oh boy, long star. Yeah, this one is one of the worst ones as well. There's not many, not too many coins extra. And the tornadoes are in random locations. I go over here just to check if something's gonna spawn, like spikies. Nope. Leave me alone. Oh my god. <laughs> I can't really get that one either. <laughs> kind of want to try though. Okay. All right, not that one. <laughs> Uh, wing cap would be great. Okay, there, there's one next to the tornado. I don't want to. I don't want that one. And I want to enter with about 45 coins at least. Oh my god. There's an $11 donation here from Pushback. He said, "Best game ever." Greetings from the audience. <laughs> These tornadoes are really got you covered. There's a spiny like all the way up there, or spiky. What are they called? Spinies? Uh, pokey. Pokies, oh yeah, pokey. <laughs> There's a pokey up there. What a wonderful box placement. <laughs> <laughs> I 
All right, now I'm actually scared because <laughs> he's uh. This is such a bully scene. What did Arthur give me, man? He's just like watching at home laughing right now. No, 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 no. <laughs> okay, give me that shell. Oh, of course, face the wrong way. This is a huge train wreck. <laughs> Speaking of trains. <laughs> Perfect. We got a $10 donation from Nancy Drew, who says, here's to the Leon B run. And another $10 from Demke, who says, shout outs to 360 Simple Flip. <laughs> <laughs> Chris Grin. And with that, I'm actually out of $10 donation train donations. And I, that can't happen. We got to keep that train going. We're actually about $9,000 away from our all time high at GDQX for that donation total. So let's please keep that $10 train going. Oh, that's all of them. Okay. All right, let get me out of this place. We have to find all the secrets and get the 100 coins. Okay. There's a $50 donation here from Michu. It says, this has been a great event so far. Thanks to everyone who has worked hard to make this happen. Let's see some Leon B action. Yeah, whatever, you can have it. Looks like we're climbing. That's normal, though. Able Gamers just got 50 bucks from Wolfrit. Says, games shape my life. So thank you, Able Gamers, for helping people experience things that I take for granted. There's the last one. Yeah. All right, all the way at the bottom. That's good. I don't know why I opened that. There's nothing. <laughs> oh, it's all good. It's all good. Yeah, the inside of the pyramid was pretty average. Just outside, we got trolled a lot by that shy guy. Here we go. Oh. Here we go. oh. It's not. I got you. I didn't do it. I got you. He saved the run. Can I say, I've seen your tech person here. <laughs> Please don't actually believe that. <laughs> anything but. The Legend of K donated enough for four $10 drain donations. That's 40 bucks saying, first donating to a game's done quick. Happy I could catch it live. Yeah, we're actually like at the final stretch, I would say. Yeah, sweet. It's a good time. My P my PB in this is uh, 226 on a random seat. Oh, hello. Oh, hey. Hi. 
Right. Um, there's nothing up here. Oh. A bunch of coins. That's it. Oh. Um, yeah, it's, it's a 226. And the estimate is the 310, which is very generous. Um, I generally get times of about 250 if I have to do like a no reset run. So I think we're in a pretty good, pretty good shape. Joe 145 donated ten dollars to add into that train and said, "I felt like a kid again the moment I heard the Penguin Race music. Thanks for such a fun speed run, speed run for such a good cause." So, was there any reason why you didn't get some more coins back there? Uh, sorry, what? I said, was there any reason why you didn't get more coins back there, even though you're going for the hundred coin star? On the uh, castle? Where, yeah. Or they're just too scary. Oh, okay. There's a there's a lot of coins. Uh, in Rainbow, right? We don't need those. Okay. Nothing on the island, that's good. I did open it just in case. We've got a $25 donation from Popo Matic, who said, I'm embarrassed to admit it, but I honestly didn't know until now that Simple Flips was a real person. <laughs> I thought that name was just part of a meme. <laughs> anyway, shout out to Simple Flips and all the folks at GDQX. I believe it. Are you a living meme then? <laughs> <laughs> I wouldn't be surprised if many people thought that to be true. Uh-oh, bonus for Jonas is getting in on the back and forth action. The donut $10 saying shout outs to Windslash who shouted to Vice, who shout out to Windslash, who shouted out Vice, who shouted out Windslash for shouting out to Simple Flips. Oh, a lot of crazy. Also had a $10 donation from, from Sushi Elemental, who said, one does not simply flip into Mordor. Well, actually, there's a clip you can do. <laughs> okay, last red coins over there. Awesome. Hopefully, there's enough uh, yellow coins with it. At least one. Monkey Boy is hashtag Team Pineapple because they said twenty-five or they sent twenty-five dollars and one cent, saying pineapple does belong on pizza. I respectfully disagree. Oh, a tiny bit short on coins now. I know. Okay, there's one up here then. Oh, we're just take this. Okay. <laughs> here we go. Awesome though, that's gonna be a carpetless uh a carpetless randomizer. Heck yeah. And people said it wasn't RTA viable. <laughs> <laughs> oh, don't grab the wrong star. <laughs> that's why they have numbers. <laughs> In an earlier version of Randomizer, they didn't have numbers yet. So if something spawned like right next to each other, you just had to guess. Oh boy. Miss Stap Cat donated twenty-five dollars. Said, as a physical therapist who has worked with disabled children, I love that you guys are supporting this charity. Keep up the good work. Thank you, Eileen Ninety, for the ten-dollar donation. And they said, you guys are cute. <laughs> Thank you. We got a ten dollar donation from shout out to Simple Flips. <laughs> we said shout out to Simple Flips says please stop shouting out Simple Flips. Says shout out to Simple Flips says shout out to 360 Chrism. Ah, <laughs> uh, no bait. All right, let's go. <laughs> I can't follow it anymore. <laughs> you gotta keep going, Hobbs. I believe in you. I believe in the people donating out there, like Brandon173, who donated $30, saying, Simple Flips gets too much love. Shout out to the guy reading the donations. Thanks. Thank you. That's Jay Hobbs, for everybody who's not aware. Yeah. So, <laughs> huge shout out to Jay Hobbs. Here we go. Well, you're going to regret saying that, because Crypt Tierth 
said, uh, sent five dollars and said, "Hey, Jay Hobbs, don't you think Darkman hangs there a little lazy on the couch? Let's wake him up a little bit." <laughs> hey, Darkman, how about a push up? <laughs> oh, <laughs> do you really want to see me exercise? Yeah. I don't think you want to. <laughs> Come on. Right. I'm going to pre-opt out of any physical exercise <laughs> on stage, if that's okay. All right, fine. I'll do it. <laughs> One push-up, huh? With the headset on and everything. Yeah, doesn't matter. Okay. It shouldn't. We'll see. All right, let's do this. <laughs> All right, there we go. That's one. <laughs> Great form. Thank you. That's like one-tenth of my limit, so don't ask me to do more. <laughs> Got a $10 anonymous donation. And they said, uh, crawls out of the lurker cave, throws money at the announcer, crawls back into the cave. <laughs> we still have not found any of the top toads. Oh. That's right, there's two more, right? What do you do 100 coins with? In THI? Uh, star number one. Okay. No! <laughs> That's alright, we'll just get him here. Yeah, I'll get it with star number one because I have to look for the piranha plants all over the place. That's clever. Thank you. <laughs> 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 Thought of it myself. <laughs> <laughs> right, I did it. That was almost bad. I got the, the yeah, you jump got the backwards. thing where you jump backwards and then that was a good save. I didn't realize how many coins are in the stage. Yeah. Demon Fire chipped in ten dollars and said, "Has anyone ever seen Simple Flips and a meme in the same room at the same time? They're the same person." <laughs> <laughs> oh, those are weird sound effect. Oh, <laughs> there's so many invisible walls in, in TTC. If only the invisible walls were random. <laughs> oh God. <laughs> Next update. Oh my god. We got $10 from shout out to Simple Flips, who says, shout out to. I lost my train of thought. <laughs> <laughs> and once again, speaking of trains, Coda Alpha throws in $10 and says, choo choo! Really close. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, you're an expert, all right? I had pure faith. Oh. Dudo is Bell donated ten dollars and said, "Shout out to my husband Shenanigans, who's watching this with me in the room. I love you, oh. Chrism. Appreciate how often he makes me watch your stream." <laughs> <laughs> Score the box placements. <laughs> oh my god. The amount of times I fell down there and grabbed a star on accident mid 100 coins <laughs> is unreal. We 
We got a $10 donation from Vicarious Vice. I think you know what that means. We got shout-outs to Winslash, who gave shout-outs to me, Darkman, and Chrism. After I gave shout-outs to him, after he gave shout-outs to me, after I gave shout-outs to him, after he gave shout-outs to Simple Flips. Also, shout-outs to j for having to read this. <laughs> oh, boy. <laughs> I'm on the island, all right? I don't know where I'm going. I'm just... All right, let's go here. General direction. Okay, there's one on the boat, one in the maze. I'm going right here. Let's go for that one. Here we go. It looks like we'll have to travel one extra time to BBH, according to my tracker. Are we missing a storm? I, I gotta pause and, and count. Unless you know. <laughs> I know. <laughs> I know that simple flush knows. <laughs> Carl Germ donated $10 and said, shout out to Dave Stereo who gave a shout out to Darkman earlier. I think. Honestly, I can't keep track of it anymore. <laughs> also, shout out to everyone on tech who's made this whole event possible. Okay, I just realized I did mismark something. And Lethal Lavaland is actually a stage, which is TTM from earlier. So whenever I'm in the basement now, I actually have to enter Lethal Lavaland. Which is not many more times, but that's all right. Okay, there's uh, three boxes in this stage. One of them has a star. I'm gonna go with a third one. Aww. Aww. <laughs> that was really good. <laughs> Just you had too good a luck, you know, so far, Chris. Sorry. No, we're not going for this. Not yet. There's the last one. I was, I was, you know, they were all pretty close. They were all pretty close, yeah. Here we go. Shout outs to our GDQ's own Prolix. Donated fifty dollars and said, "Shout outs to Darkman for shouting out J-Hobs. Good luck on the rest of the run, Chrism." <laughs> oh no, that is a death I cannot avoid. <laughs> that is so unfortunate. Well, hey, at least you have to go to you know. Yeah, we have to go to Lethal Lounge anyway. Yeah, works so out. It's all so calculated. calculated. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> all right. <laughs> No! <laughs> what are you doing? All right, that wasn't calculated. All right, first death, unfortunate. <laughs> it was because he needed to find the toads. Oh, that's right. Yeah, exactly. That's what I'm doing right now. Yeah, yeah. They're not here. Where are they? <laughs> <laughs> We're running out of uh, calculations here. They're literally nowhere. <laughs> They're probably in, in the staircase or all the way up top. Like top of the castle top? No, like um, next to the infinite stairs. Oh, okay. Here we go. Can, can they be at the top of the castle? Nah. No, they need to be in this loading area. Oh, okay. <laughs> Slowpoke216 donated and said, Here are $5 for that amazing display of strength with that push up. Also, shout out to Simple Flips. <laughs> One way of putting it. <laughs> Imaginary Incorporated wants to see more because they said five dollars for five more push-ups. That should be within the limit, right? <laughs> Technically, I don't know though. If I, a dollar a push-up, you gotta go more than that. Sorry. Ooh, Ooh challenge has been sent. <laughs> <laughs> Winslash donated again, $25. It says, no, but seriously, shout-outs to Chrism for this amazing run. No oh. japes. Oh. Uh, but also shout-outs to J-Hubs for shouting out bonus for Jonas, for shouting out me, for shouting out Vice, for shouting... Uh, wait, how many shout-outs are we at now? Oh. 
<laughs> DJ OK threw a $25 and said, why are we shouting? <laughs> Love all things GDQ. Thanks for keeping us entertained, and let's get some specialty controllers into the hands of those who need them. Yeah, this, this star in JRB is a little annoying because if the chest can be just everywhere, so you you'll be swimming a lot. And back in the cave. <laughs> wanted to take a moment to give everybody an update on those bid wars we got coming up for Resident Evil 2. The soundtrack choice is currently winning. Uh, the classic uh, soundtrack is winning, but it's only winning by $10. So if you want that remake soundtrack to happen, it's only going to cost you a little over 10 bucks. There's also the Resident Evil 2 costume choice. And right now, 98 is in the lead with $720. And Noir is just behind it at 545 Arclay Sheriff at 525 in third. Don't forget, folks, that there are plenty of amazing prizes you can be entered in the chance to win just by donating $10 or maybe even a little bit more. I think all the way up to $50 is our biggest minimum donation, but there are so many for just $10, like the Breath of the Wild chainmail cuff you saw before, this, or the uh, Super Meat Boy Forever plushes. Plenty more to see at GamesDoneQuick.com for more information. And another 100. Not sure if this is the last one. Oh no, we still need to do TTM. Hmm. Got 20 bucks from Darworth. They said, two tickets for the donation train, please. One ticket for me, and the other for my shout outs to Simple Flips. <laughs> choo choo. <laughs> Doc's Delicious also thrown in 10, saying, Thanks for playing one of my favorite games of my childhood for my birthday today. Been watching GDQ since 2015, but this is my first time donating. Shout out to the wonderful community who managed these events and put on a great show. You guys are amazing. Oh, thank you. No more shy guys. I'm done with them for today. <laughs> Uh-oh, Tobias is back with 25 bucks and says, okay, how about $5 per push-up? Hmm. I'll let Simple Flips decide my fate. I hope someone drops like 500 and you're just like I'll, working I'll out match for him. the rest of the run. What'd you say? I'll match him. So does that mean I have to do 10? 10? No, 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 no. That just means I'll I do just five. match his five per... Oh, uh, so you're telling me now at $10 per push-up I'm going to do five? Yeah. All right, that's fine. Hey. <laughs> 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 Why am I doing this? <laughs> For charity. Yeah. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> Do you regret wanting to be on this couch yet? <laughs> I regret everything in my life. <laughs> A ten dollar donation from Brandon two twenty one said, "Rolling around at the speed of sound, got places to go, gotta follow my." Wait, wrong game. <laughs> I mean, uh, Wahoo. Also, shout outs to everyone in the audience and everyone watching the live stream. Oh, party! A few people wanted to make sure that you did them, Dark Man. So we had a hundred dollars from Cannon who said, "Push up, please." And thirty dollars from Pop Twenty Seven who said, "Do the push-ups, dude." So wait, so do I have to do more that. now? No, I think you're good. I, I'm good. All right, I'm good. We're good. Oh 
All right, listen, hold on, hold on. I'm at four left, all right? You know, so <laughs> we have to make this count, okay? <laughs> yeah, that 10 is a daily limit. <laughs> I didn't say anything of a daily limit, okay? It's like probably like a yearly limit. Anonymous donated fifteen dollars and says, "Go one twenty star." I appreciate that you did a hundred coin star and for a star hundred. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> I like the flavor. <laughs> All right, let's not spawn on the top of the pyramid. All right, <laughs> it's okay. You still have to go to Lethal Lava Land. It's fine. Oh. Yeah, I'll have to tank the tornado to get that. Wing cap. Oh, get out of here. Okay, <laughs> we're done. <laughs> Luckily, we're not done with shout outs. So we got $10 from the nope. Game label. We said, Outflips to Simple Chrism, J Dark's 360 Man, and Shout Hobbs. <laughs> I'm not sure what I just heard. Also got $25 from Simple Flips. It says shout outs to push ups. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> 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 Dexter184 added $100 onto that donation total, saying shout out to shout outs. That's my favorite shout out. <laughs> we also have $13.57 from XL Worm, who said, This is only to bother the people who like neat, even numbers. How dare you? <laughs> hmm. I'm not sure if that's in reach. Uh. <laughs> oh my Cal calculated, God. definitely calculated. Oh my God. <laughs> you knew. I, I, thought he could, I thought he went left, no, right? <laughs> <laughs> oh, that would have been awful at the end of the storm. <laughs> At free, you donate, donated $10 and said, shout outs to everyone making events like this happen. Everyone volunteering behind the scenes, heart. Dude, they're like all here. <laughs> I, I thought I saw a shadow right there. It's a shy guy in the back. You know what? Whatever. <laughs> <laughs> they healed me too much. I cannot see what that is. It, it was, was a Goomba. Goomba. It's a Goomba. Uh, yeah, I was like, is that a Goomba? I thought it was a red coin at first. <laughs> Darkman, I think we're going to hit your yearly limit because we got $100 from B Natural, who said, So glad to be able to see my first GDQ live at TwitchCon. This must be worth a few more push ups, right? Thanks for the great cause, and here's the best platformer of all time. Oh, we got to milk this. I'm saying that's worth two push ups. Ooh. <laughs> that's all right. Price goes up, all right, as you get close to your limit. I'm just saying. It's a bidding war at this point, huh? <laughs> <laughs> all right, all right. Two push ups. That's fine. No problem. I gotta do the slow one for this one. Yeah, I gotta make it count. <laughs> it, it's not because I can't do it. I promise. I can feel the, the ground <laughs> <Yeah>. shaking. <laughs> Might be my arm shaking a lot. <laughs> oh, I got two left. This might be the most number of times Darkman's gotten a round of applause without doing a run. 
<laughs> that, that probably includes doing a run. <laughs> Uh oh, I'm out of donation train donations, so I think you all know what that means out there, chat. Let's get more $10 donations happening. Darkman got a lot of applause when he was reading inspirational quotes from the Beyblade anime. <laughs> <laughs> you know, that's honestly like one of one of like my more like prouder moments, I think, <laughs> when I've been on stream. Like I really like I really like that. I clearly missed out on something great. I don't know <laughs> you really did. Uh, I did a Beyblade run at GDQX last year, and I put Darkman on the couch to read out <laughs> inspirational quotes from the show. Yeah. There was pre there were some pretty good ones. <laughs> the final one was basically like a minute and a half monologue from one of the characters. It was That's great. great. <laughs> <laughs> You're really just not gonna get him. No. <laughs> hey. There we go. All right, that's, that's a plot for that. <laughs> There's a red coin on there. A warp. What? <laughs> I was gonna ask how you're gonna get back. Pog champ in the chat. I've never seen it before. <laughs> No, not worth it. <laughs> oh, man. We've got 20 bucks from RazorWindX17. Said 120 star, 120 star. <laughs> 10 coins. I might have to do the slide again. <laughs> Boxes that have coins on this stage. Nope, no, no coins in boxes. Yeah, I think it's worth it. Uh, there is another, at least another five coins on the slide really easily, uh, right behind me here. Does the slide always spawn you at the start of the stage in the randomizer, or no, is it it's, random? No, it's at the first, like, third of the, the slide. And... Oh, I mean when could... you finish it. Oh, that's random, completely random, oh. where it spawns me when I'm done. Could be on top of the mountain now. Okay, five more I can find. <laughs> hey, there you go. Uh, through like Goombas and whatnot. All right, let's not grab another coin in this slide. Probably not ideal now. Yeah. Well, what if I on accident? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> That's scary. <laughs> yeah, this guy. <laughs> <laughs> All right. <laughs> Good game. Coins, right? Uh, I think so. That was the last. Oh, JRB 100. Ah. Uh. But JRB 100 is really fast, actually, because there's so many extra coins now. JRB 100 is actually a star I would consider in 70 star. That's how fast it is. Oh, wow. Because sometimes there's 80 coins in the cage. The uh, cave, I mean. <laughs> oh, there's the oh, there. oh, hey. <laughs> There's all three of them. Two of them have a start. They're just having a party. Yeah. Here we go. Woo. 
not that one. Here we go. Right, so you can get 15 stars in like three minutes, right? Oh yeah, easily. Okay. On the cruiser. And this is the last star in Rainbow Ride, I think. We've got a $20 donation from Push Ups that say shout outs to Simple Flips. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't know my Push Ups could talk. <laughs> I also have $100 from Canon. It says, how about a sit up? <laughs> One set up? Okay. Maybe we can just run him uh, have him run around here. One set up is fine with me. You want to be in my spot? <laughs> I'll pass. <laughs> oh, hold on. Hold on. This is difficult. All right. All right. There you go. One. Never mind that the legs went up. It doesn't count. <laughs> We have ten dollars from Oceanity, Oceanity Thirty, who says those push-ups are getting pretty pricey. I wonder how much setups would cost. Shout out to exercise. <laughs> well, I think we just found yeah. out setups cost at least a hundred dollars. So. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I might have been willing to go lower, but now you can't go lower once it's been set. So oh, sorry. somebody beat you to it. <laughs> We've got $10 from Mauser08, who says, I just can't let this event end without donating. Keep up the amazing work. Anonymous donor threw in $100 with no comment. Thank you very much. And Ken221 sent $30 and just said, nice. 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 See what you mean about the star. Yeah, yeah, look at these points. There's so <laughs> many here. Um, Rotzer sent in $25 and said, thanks for all every year. So I have $10 from Blute Flag. It says... Choo choo! Shout out to Simple Flips. <laughs> Would like to take a moment to check back in on that Resident Evil 2 uh, incentive, the alternative campaign, Leon, I believe. That is currently sitting at $2,500 out of 20,000, so a little over 10% of the way. Sure, we can make that one happen. Do want to see that different campaign. Train ticket donated $25 with just a heart. Thanks for hopping on board. <laughs> <laughs> what a spawn. Nightmare fuel. That thing was so scary <laughs> as a kid. <laughs> I agree. We've got $10 from Ray Prower, who says, A little late, but I was incredibly moved by Edobean's amazing Tetris attack run. Here's to keeping the $10 train going. I've actually never accidentally jumped in that pipe before, but I know a lot of people have. <laughs> Have you ever done that? No, but I've seen it too. Yeah. Oh. That's rude. I might actually have to redo the star. Uh oh. Um. Oh, does it disappear if you go big? It does. <laughs> yeah, I have to walk there. Um, I have to jump on top of it because it's so far out and then it's on a platform where you can't jump high off. So let's see if we can spot it. 
You should be able to wall kick to that. Nah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, it was close enough to the wall. But yeah, I'm glad we well, yeah, whatever. You, jumped you, you got it. You got it. You jumped into it. <laughs> <laughs> that was the only way, and it was really difficult, simple. <laughs> You're right. <laughs> Why are you trying to make him look that? <laughs> In the box. <laughs> That's a good spot for where the start is. Cleric150 donated $25 with no comment. Thank you for the donation. We also have $25 from Debro, who said, No one gets away from Inspector Gadget and gets away with it. Quote from Inspector Gadget, maybe? <laughs> <laughs> Also have twenty dollars from Rebecca's friend Rye. Said shout out to Rebecca. Enjoy those Twizzlers. <laughs> I don't think we've been looped in on something here. <laughs> An anonymous crowd member donated ten dollars and said, "First time live in the crowd. Been a fan for years. Thanks for all you do. Thank you for your donation." Oh, I didn't get star number one yet. Here we go. Okay, from TTM. Since we died in Shifting Sandland, and uh, you get two Shifting Sandland through THI, I'll go there now. And that's that's fixes the route already. Oh, the open star we're missing. All right. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> it's just trying to give you height so you can see where it is. Got a hundred dollar donation from Ross53 who said, shout, shout. Let it all out. <laughs> Here is money I can do without. Come on. I wonder if he went for that bait intentionally or not. <laughs> I think so. I think so too. Scale them out. Got a $5 donation from Chibi Scala, who says, Hey, Darkman, remember to stretch out or else you'll be hurting tomorrow with all this exercise. You're right. Yeah, yeah. Hold on. <laughs> oh, boy. Yep, yep. Five seconds. All right, that's good. Yep. Right. Similarly, <laughs> Sin Life donated uh, $10 and said, Friendly reminder to also exercise your wrists after long sessions. It's true. Very important. I don't know if that means long sessions of the exercise or of the <laughs> gameplay, but either way. <laughs> Okay, now I'm checking if I need stars. Yeah. I'm glad you were able to process that because that made zero sense to me. <laughs> what? Just the, looking the at the menu. <laughs> <laughs> the only thing I know at this point is I know he has to go to Lethal Lava Land. <laughs> yeah, we're, we're missing star in BBH, and that's right here, so that's why. That's why I'm looking through it. It makes sense when you see both. <laughs> yeah. I'm just going to go with you're really good and I'm not. All right. <laughs> <laughs> We've got a few more donations, just basically trying to get Darkman to do things. Mm. <laughs> so we got $25 from Sassy Pants. He says, how about $25 for a jumping jack? <laughs> oh, God. I'm probably going to draw the line at jumping jacks. Yeah. <laughs> we don't want to bump the console. <laughs> no. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. Thank you for the donation, though. But we also have $20 from Remote Cube who said, How much for an IRL backwards long jump? <laughs> <laughs> How does that even work? I'm going to opt out of that one myself. Too. If you can figure out the physics behind it, I'll consider it. We got $20 from Anonymous, Anonymous who says, Shout outs to talking quietly and not disturbing others. <laughs> It's so funny that you tried to do that because I was hoping that yeah, you tried to do that. I, I wasn't, it was too far, sadly. <laughs> you got to go for the cool strats whenever you can. Oh, 
are secrets in Bottom of Battlefield. Do you remember from 20 minutes ago where all the secrets are? <laughs> a little bit, actually. I think I, think I do, too. Actually. A little bit. There was one really high up here somewhere. Yeah. One on the island, so I gotta get a wink up for that. Cherry Shades donated $10 with a poem. They said, these donations have lots of quips, as Chrism makes Mario do flips. Let's get some applause for supporting this cause. Shout out to Simple <laughs> Flips. Beautiful. <laughs> Try it without, I guess. Maybe? Yeah, yeah, yeah nice. Maybe. That one was. I don't remember. I don't remember. Alright, well, we're on a magical journey. Uh, I think it was somewhere you'd be able to see it doing the Cooper race. <laughs> Very <laughs> thanks, <laughs> It does eliminate a lot of areas. Okay. I guess. <laughs> He's actually going back I'm up. I'm going back up. <laughs> Sergeant Baja donated $25 and said, Looking forward to AGDQ 2020, the first GDQ I'll be able to attend. And while we're doing shout outs, shout out to Able Gamers and all the wonderful charities GDQ has benefited throughout the years. Oh, that's a great shout out. For the record, I saw that secret earlier. I just didn't want to tell you. <laughs> right. <laughs> yeah, Sam, I already knew no. it. <laughs> Back on the island. No, this is a great star. Hey, it's actually, you know what? It's not the right one to bring. <laughs> <laughs> There's two pink bombs here. You thought it'd be that easy. Dying Goose donated $43.43. They said, donating this last amount to bring my total to $100. Shout out to everyone involved, and a special shout out to Red Luigi, who is going, who is doing some good jumping on screen. Also, could we continue to exercise by planking? Pretty sure that fad died out like two years ago. <laughs> <laughs> no comment. All right, well, Count, ha Count Hanks uh, donated $30 and said, okay, how about half a squat? <laughs> also, shout outs to something. <laughs> no, definitely not. Shout outs to something, I like it. <laughs> What's half a squat? I, I don't know, to be honest. <laughs> Uh, Fifteen dollars from Gail, who asks, "Can we get Darkman to demonstrate how to do a simple flip?" Also, shout out to simple flips. <laughs> if I wasn't gonna break every bone in my body, sure. <laughs> nope. Got fifty bucks from Cephalia, who said, "I've enjoyed seeing GDQ evolve to include more randomizers." Shout outs to push-ups. That was a bad idea. <laughs> <laughs> you just, you gotta get the last coin. Okay. Nope. Remember everyone out there that last year's GDQX donation total was just over $139,000, and we really want to make it a uh, much bigger total this year. We want to pass that mark. So we're doing pretty good. We're at 134000 right now, and let's make it happen. 140 is the mark to look for. Hey, Darkman, how about $30 for a lunge? 
That comes from Willie W. J. A lunch? I don't even know what a lunch is. No, to go to lunch. Oh, to him. go to lunch? Yeah. You could interpret it that way <laughs> if you wanted. True. <laughs> if they're paying, I guess. Yeah, thirty dollar lunch with Dark Man is a steal. No, they gotta pay me thirty dollars and then pay for lunch. <laughs> that, no, that's fine. So yeah, we did red coins earlier already on accident. Mm, okay. Based on my calculations. Uh, yeah. <laughs> uh, <laughs> nice calculations. I think THI makes sense, and then that way we'll get to shifting sand lint really quick. I approve. Three stars. Intentional? Yeah. Oh, yeah, that was definitely faster than traveling all the way to the basement. Yeah. Ten dollars from Washed, who says, very nice. We can never spawn high in this level. <laughs> Shout246 donated $10 and said, Nice stream. I love the cause. Keep it going. Shout out. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> also have $25 from Fiery C donating towards that Resident Evil 2 alternative campaign incentive. They said, Leon A, everyone knows B scenario is where it's at. Let's get that incentive met. I agree. That is... Almost at three thousand dollars out of the twenty thousand. There's still a little bit of time left to make that one happen, but be sure to be putting your donations towards that incentive. All right, and the last star is tactically placed in Dark World, like I mentioned earlier, mm -hmm. because we totally died there on purpose. <laughs> We have a $5 donation from Anonymous, who says, thanks for brightening up my weekend. Thank you for the donation. Silverstorm is excited for Resident Evil 2 and donated 50 bucks, saying, can't wait for Mr. X. All right, let's not tactically die again, though. We're going to the final level. Oh, baby. About a 245 pace. It's pretty good. It's all right, yeah. With all the crap that happened, I think that's pretty all right. <laughs> I mean, you could have said that's, like, amazing. I could have. Uh, I already mentioned my PBR. Yeah, you though. did, though. <laughs> that was a missed opportunity, though. Should have never mentioned it. <laughs> Whoa. Oh, it's a lot of Goombas. Noah Six donated ten dollars and said, "I love GDQ. We love you, Noah." Uh, there's something there. Yeah. <laughs> what? Like a red coin? <laughs> Did you see a red coin? No, no. no. He's talking about the thing <laughs> you're standing on. <laughs> oh. Made in America donated $10 while you're in the dark world here and said, choo-choo. I'm just saying, y'all have like a minute or two left to get me to do two more push-ups. Just saying. <laughs> what was the bidding price, the asking rate? <laughs> the going rate well, we, I set it at 50 bucks for a push-up. That was the last time. There's got to be more than that, though. Right. So. so maybe somebody coming in with a $200 donation could make maybe. it happen. I might even go over my limit if you donate the right amount. Ooh. I'm just saying. Wow. Unprecedented <laughs> push-ups. Silver126 donated $20 and said, I work with students with disabilities, and before today, I had never heard of the Able Gamers Foundation. Thank you for putting them on my radar. Here's $20 for the Austin Mario run. Oh. 
can't see the shadow, so I don't even know. <laughs> oh my god, where is it? <laughs> oh my. I'm gonna die to fall then. <laughs> no, 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 you're not gonna die. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> There's a ten dollar donation here from Anonymous that says, "Looking forward to Darkman's We Fit speed run in the next GDQ." We fit. Let's go. God. I play that game. It's impossible. Devo donated twenty five dollars. Said, "The more people playing video games, the better." So let's get behind this awesome cause and event. And then they put a you know like flexing muscle emote for you there, Darkman. <laughs> Heck yeah. <laughs> The trolls you here, huh? No, they were having a Goomba party down below. <laughs> uh, all right. Perfect throws? <laughs> right. All right. So, yes. Yes. No. All right, well. <laughs> Well, um, you know, it's a different setup than I'm used to, so... <laughs> <laughs> because I got to sneak it in there, we got 50 bucks from Mooing Lemur, who said, How about an anagram? Slump, too selfish to sit up, is an anagram of shoutouts to Simple Flip. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Nice. And time is when we grab the big star. That was a lot of fun. Uh... <laughs> awesome. Nice ride, dude. Yeah, that was a lot of fun. Thank you guys. Uh, thank you guys for couching. That was, that was great. Good memes. <laughs> a little bit too many shout outs for you, but right. There's never enough shout outs. Um, yeah, I don't know. If you like right. watching this kind of stuff, I actually love randomizers so much. That's Mostly what I stream, uh, I stream Mario 64 randomizers, Pokemon randomizers, if you want to check them out. I'm on Twitch. Um, other than that, thank you so much, GDQ, for letting me run this. It was a great time. And next time, I'll beat that by 10 minutes. Okay. All right. <laughs> oh. So what if you don't beat it, then? What? What if you don't beat it? 10 push-ups. <laughs> then, I'll, then I'll donate $100. All right, perfect. There you go. Got it. <laughs> All right, yeah, that's going to be it. Thank you, guys. Thank you, Chrism, Darkman, and Simple Flips for a super entertaining run. Thank you, everybody out there, for donating during it. Going to quickly say thank you to Grimelios for the $10 donation. He said, we've, been seeing, we've seen plenty of exercise from Darkman, but how much for a push-up from J-Hobbs? And I'm sorry, Grim, there is not enough money in the world. Got 20 bucks from Anonymous that says, shout out to flips that aren't complex. So classic, so relaxing, so serene. We also have $25 from Saturn's with a simple heart. Thank you. And with that, I'm going to go ahead and send us over to some Twitch ads. We'll see you on the other side.
Welcome back from those ads. Thanks for sticking through the break with us. I want to tell you a little bit about one of our sponsors here. We got Twitch. Games Done Quick Express 2019 is powered by Twitch. For those of you attending TwitchCon this weekend, visit us in room 6D on the second floor next to Twitch Rivals. Our marathon space will be open to spectators 24 hours, including overnight, throughout TwitchCon weekend. Still have two runs to go before we hit that finale of the stream. So please, if you haven't gotten a chance, be sure to swing on by. Also want to tell you a little bit about the Yeti. The Yeti, I mean, you know them by this, at this point. They've been supporting Games Done Quick events since 2012. They are the official t-shirt sponsor for Games Done Quick. But did you know that you can get official GDQ XTs and more at theyeti.com? That's T-H-E-Y-E-T-E-E.com. Quick reminder about some of the things you can put your donations towards. There's currently, uh, there are two bid wars actually currently for Resident Evil 2. The soundtrack choice, currently Classic is winning at $628.57, whereas Remake sitting at $540. It's been back and forth for those two, so few donations here there could easily flip that one. We also have the costume choice for Resident Evil 2. Currently, 98 is sitting in the lead at $1,015 or $1,015 and one cent, whereas Noir is at $691. Arclay Sheriff at $545 in third. And then there are also alternative outfits and standard outfits that have just around $50. There's also a challenge incentive for Resident Evil 2. If we get to $20,000 on that incentive before the run starts, then we'll actually do the Resident Evil 2 alternative campaign. Currently sitting at $3,140.86. So we still got a ways to go on that one, but there's some time left. I believe we can make it happen. Don't forget that if you do donate, there are plenty of prizes that you are automatically entered in the running to win. $5 minimum donation will put you into the Triforce, Heart, and Pen Pen pins. $10 minimum donation puts you into the running for several different things, actually, including a PlayStation 4 Pro. So please be sure to donate. And then, of course, our grand prize of the Spyro-themed Nintendo Switch is a $50 minimum donation to be entered in the drawing for that one. Plenty of other prizes uh, that you can potentially win. You can check those out at gamesdonequick.com. It's also where you can donate conveniently.
Uh, we have a $10 donation from the Chain Nerd, who's actually donated a lot of prizes to us in the past. Thank you. Um, they said, wow, I'm loving watching this Fitness Done Quick Express program. More, please. And with that, that is going to do it for me here, folks. So thank you so much for the entertaining donations. I'm going to pass the mic off to Beef Salt to take care of you through the new Super Mario Brothers Wii Run. Hello everyone, welcome to GDQ 2019. Uh, this is Beep Salt on the mic. Uh, we are waiting a couple more minutes, but I'll read a couple donations here. We have $25 from San Serif, says, enjoy watching this mini GDQ. Big thanks to the runners, announcers, crew, sponsors, and everyone who makes this special event possible. Rock on. We are at about $3,430 of this $20,000 Resident Evil 2 alternative campaign. So if you all want to get in on that, we got a little bit of time left to get donating. All right, I'm going to hit y'all with some more donations. We got $20 from Neophage, says thank you for a great event. We got $10 from BA Lum, says this has been an awesome event and it's great to have money to donate now. We got $20 from Anonymous, it says excellent games and an excellent charity. We got another 20 from another anonymous, says, I really look up to you all. Playing games and having fun while earning money to help people is amazing.
since I've been talking about the charity a little bit, let me talk a little bit about Able Gamers. There are millions of people with disabilities who can't play video games without expensive specialized equipment. The Able Gamers charity helps gamers with disabilities by providing that equipment free of charge. Their mission is to create opportunities that enable play in order to combat social isolation, foster inclusive communities, and improve the quality of life for people with disabilities. And with that, I'm